Mrs. Cooker, Miss Jen Carillo. My name is Jen Carrillo, and I'm here representing uh, Illinois People's Action. Uh, and as Sunny mentioned, I'm also a candidate for Bloomington City Council. Uh, I came to the United States when I was 10 years old. Uh, there's actually some people here in the crowd who were among the first to welcome me uh, into this country. Um, and uh, as an immigrant and as someone who lived as an undocumented person for over a decade, I understand firsthand the ways in which our racist immigration system works to maintain a subclass of people and employs terror as a means to keep us silent in our exploitation. Uh, as an immigrant, I know that the American dream is not the reality that, when we, that we encounter when we come here. But I don't just know that as an immigrant. I also know that as a resident of central Illinois, which is the place that I have chosen as my home and the place where I have decided to lay down my roots. The American dream isn't the reality for a lot of the people whose parents, grandparents, and great-grandparents sought hope and refuge here in places like Dwight many generations ago either. Today, we show up not only to call on Dwight to do what is right, but in solidarity with the people here and throughout this part of the state and throughout the entire country. People whose struggle leaves them desperate and eager for something to sustain their families, just like the families that, that moneyed interest is seeking to detain here today. We come today to ask the people of Dwight not to do the bidding of the real outsiders, which is not us. The real outsiders have no roots in this community and sell human bondage for a buck and expect the people in this community to do their dirty work for them. That ain't right. That ain't right. That ain't right. We ask the people of Dwight to stand together with us, our neighbors, and to join us in fighting for dignity that includes all of us. This is the game that corporations in cahoots with opportunistic politicians have been playing for decades now to serve their own interests and line their own pockets. They change the rules of the game to make it cheaper and more profitable for corporations to leave places like this uh, and go to places like where I come from, uh, leaving communities like this barren and unable to support a dignified life for their people. These same corporations then invaded our home countries to extract all the possible wealth from our people and the earth. Um, and once they have sucked us dry, they moved on to the next That's thing, right. Right. leaving us in shambles and forcing us to seek refuge in neighboring economies. Yeah. That is why we are here. Yeah. Then once we're here, we are exploited, abused as workers by another set of people seeking to profit from us. And then again, when we are criminalized and hunted down by ICE 